Okay, welcome back to the channel. So we're at 22 subscribers and at 20, I said I would do a full farm review. You're probably wondering, this isn't the farm we saw when you did your reviews. And you think, oh, maybe that's it. Well, no, I've moved my farm because I move it often. And so here it is. Now, the first thing you might be thinking is, this is not as much animals as you expected, maybe. Well, I have kept all my shalike, or most of my shalike, so I can make a really good review video and not rush past them in the farm. I hope you enjoy and let's get into the farm tour. So coming through here, we're tractors with trailers, we'll come into the farm. We get greeted by this little, quite like a poodle dog that I like to call Bonnie with a puppy. And then if we swivel here, there's this internal storage bit here out, uh, out so you can store you can store like bowls and I like to keep dog food in there and like a bone. Ah, uh, so let's put a bone in there or even let's give it to the dog here. So I'll close that up and inside here, there's a window and yes, yeah, so it's quite a nice little kennel. I got it with set with a little girl and a dog that I like to call, uh, call Biscuit. So let's come into the sheep pen here so coming into the sheep pen we have got a ram and a sheep with lambs and the shepherd dog or a collie dog anyway i know you shouldn't have the ram in when it has lambs but i could have put it in a shedding pen but at the time i didn't really think of it and it looks quite nice here so we've got a nice black sheep which is she like some last year's lambs in here we've got a whole bunch of sheep in here and then I said the sheepdog and then the ram. This is not my good shalike ram, as you can see. That's because it's not in this farm setup because I like to vary it. So if we come out of the sheep pen and close that gate so they don't escape and go round here, we have got the thing I've spent the most time on. Now this barn, I was even thinking of making a separate video for it by the amount of time I spent on it. So if I come around here, just before the barn, we've got this alleyway and uh, me leaving this uh, drainage pipe drainage pipe here. We've got this cat down this alleyway where the barn meets to the field in here. But let's come along and go into the barn. First of all, we get greeted by a man fixing his tractor in here, which is a JCB tractor. And then if we come along here, we've got the pigs. Now, this may seem like just like this was the barn set up, but no, this pipe here was on the other side here. I switched it, took off that pipe because this doesn't fit anymore because I moved it. Uh, that wall used to be on the back of there. I took it out and put it on here, added some shalike fencing or not shalike fencing anyway, um, some other brand fencing and add it in there. So now my pigs have got a shed here and also back here, an area in which if I flip the camera, you can kind of see they get out from there and then they get into the pig sty pen area where they're gonna eat and snuffle about with. And if we go over here, we've got this mini milking parlor bit and one of the cutest dogs I have here here which is this and so you can see how just the puppy is like lying on the mum and if we come round we've got a chicken coop once again I can't review the chickens because they're going to go on a video later so yeah and I don't, I'm not sure what to put in here so I'm probably going to put sheep um other sheep or cattle anyway because I've not got much cattle in this display but uh comment down below on what you think I could put in here if we spin round, we have got this pretty much green almost dispenser kind of like. So if I tug that, my uh, my brother made this for me, you'd have green in there and then you would tug that here and all the green would pour out. And next to it, we've got the cat and her kittens. I named this cat Guzzy after our cat Guzzy. And then the other cat is up here on the post. So we're going to miss this out. We're going to do that at the end here. But 
Here we've got, once again, the rabbit hutch here without the rabbits because there will be a rabbit review. But once every animal, once I've reviewed in every animal, I might do a, uh, a tour with every single animal in it. So leave a like if you want to see that. Now, if we do hit 30 subscribers, I think I'm going to do some sort of big farm review too. I might move up my whole farm and change the whole farm look for 30 subscribers. So if we could hit 30 subscribers, we could do that. That would be great. Now here, we've got the cows and their calves. Uh, that's a bull. I'm pretending it's a cow because cows don't usually have calves. Sometimes they do. Most cows will not have a will not have twins in their lives so you know they don't have calves out one year but they might have, they'll have a calf they're breeding anyway so we've got the cows in here and another bull so that's kind of two bulls but i'm just pretending they're cows and a collie so i've got two he two things here where you maybe put a six sick sheep a sick sheep that's kind of tongue twister or maybe i'm not just saying it right and so if you'd have all the sheep in here, chew them up, put the sex sheep in there, and then you'd put the rest in there. Once again, got another one here, but now we're going to move on to here. We've got the John Deere tractor up here with a trailer you put the bales on. We've got where you'll keep the cows. We've got where you'll keep the sheep. And we've got where you keep the pigs. And then I've got the Land Rover and Range Rover. Land Rover's first and the Range Rover's at the back there. And we've got the bale, and we've got some wool. And if I come up here, I'll open this roof up here to reveal where I would also put a sex sheep. Once we change them all up, put the sex sheep round and in there. So that's where I put sex sheep, maybe geese or maybe a dog or something. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. This was kind of rushed, but it's hit seven minutes and I didn't really want it to get so, such a long time, but it has. Um, and I'll see you in our next video, but if you really want to see this in full detail, I can make a longer one if you really want to. So thank you and I'll see you in our next video.